We're enjoying that Midsummer Murders classic theme tune as this Sunday the drama returns on ITV1 and ITVX for a brand new murder mystery. Yes, there have been lots of strange and suspicious goings on in Midsummer over the years, but this Sunday things are set to get even more dramatic when, wait for it, yes. our very own Holly Willoughby makes her acting debut. It's the iconic show that's had viewers gasping for 26 years over the mystery murders. Often quite bizarre, from someone being crushed to death by a giant round of cheese or death by a candle wax. It's, of course, Midsummer Murders. And there's no bigger fan than our very own Holly. I've seen yes. every single episode. So imagine her absolute joy when stars of the show, Neil Dudgeon and Nick Hendricks, said this during an interview. We've all had a big talk about who we want to appear on Midsummer. We've decided we want Holly Willoughby to appear in an episode of Midsummer Murders very soon. I mean, you're going to have to, like, kill me off really quickly because I'm terrible at acting. All right, Holes, have a little faith in yourself because now it's your time to shine. The cast and crew are set up and ready to film the new episode in the fictitious county of Midsummer. And Holly's behind the scenes getting ready for her starring role. Well, here I am. The day has finally arrived. Dreams are coming true. You're witnessing the birth of an acting star. Probably not. And it's quite exciting. It was a very early start this morning. There's lots of actors milling around. There's people in costumes. I'm about to say it actually feels like I'm on the set of Midsummer Murders, which is actually what I'm doing, but it is so Midsummer. <laughs> Holly's joining the prestigious club of famous faces to make a cameo on the popular drama. From Orlando Bloom being stabbed with a pitchfork to Oscar winner Olivia Colman's cunning killer antics. There you are. But what's in store for our Holly? Will she too meet her grisly end or perhaps be unmasked as a killer? As you can see, my script is very weighty because I have a really huge role to play in this. Um, I'm actually playing myself. I think I can manage that. I've got a couple of lines, which I've been learning all night, which are still going round and round in my head, and I'm hoping I'm going to be able to deliver. So I'm going to go and get dressed and get ready for to get on set. See you in a minute. Holly has two scenes in the episode called Witches of Angels Rise, where she attends a psychic fair and is friendly with the white witch community. Is that the Queen of Daytime? Gloria Honeyford? You sure? Cheeky? Well, she certainly looks the part, but how's she getting on? Action. It's feng shui. Here the energy... So I've just shot my first scene, and total transparency. Uh, it was a scene I hadn't actually noticed that was in my script because I was so focused on the three lines that I had later that I didn't realise I had to say excuse me. So when I walked in and everybody was running their lines, I was like, and where is this in here? Thankfully, it was only a shot at the back of my head, so, so far... So good, I think. She might have got away with that. Surely nothing else could go wrong. Good morning, Felix. All good. Oh, tough, 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 tough. I made it until the very last minute and then I fell over. <laughs> Who put that slope there? Whoops. After a few little slip ups, it's probably best Holly takes note from the professionals. I need some serious tips mm. because I've noticed in there where obviously I'm yet to get out the perfect line. You haven't made any mistakes. Is there such a thing as the perfect line? Well, You've got to be very zen about this and think you can't aim for the perfection too much. It's that sort of mixture of looking out like you're listening without actually listening, but enough listening that you get your cue and then you can... All you know, right, well, that is good advice. Thank you. I'll see you on set. Yeah, I, I've yes. really got to go and learn She's my lines. She's got all the lingo, hasn't she? See you on set and all that. That's yeah. what you say, isn't it? Start Break a leg. Start working with Judy Dench in it. <laughs> After those words of wisdom, it all starts to fall into place. Excuse me. Dealing with a feng shui catastrophe of epic proportions. Dharma chakra. Thank you. Got there? Right there. That was amazing. She's impressing herself as well as the stars. She's acing it. I think the sort of having to learn lines or whatever was a sort of a, a slight concern, but she was great. I mean, brilliant and lovely and bubbly and, um, and brilliant and all the things that you would expect from dear Holly. Wow. Yeah, I'm not show off or anything, but I think I absolutely nailed that. Um, I hope I haven't peaked too soon, but that was my best one yet. Well done, Holly. You look like a pro. Now to see her hard work in action. Oh, hello. I'm glad I bumped into you. I've got something for you. But how did you know? The girls had a hunch. Whoa, 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 we'll have to stop right there. 
we don't want to give too much away. To watch the full episode, you'll have to tune in to ITV this Sunday. Until then, though, we best unplug the phones in case Hollywood comes calling and tries taking our girl. How exciting. I know, amazing. I love that. I you love know, that it. show's been around since 1997. Is it really? And it's still going strong on Well, ITV. it's about to be the best it's ever been. You can watch Holly's dramatic trip to the British countryside where Midsummer Murders returns this Sunday at 8pm on ITV1 and ITVX. <laughs>